Desi Doyle and I catch for the Merrill Chevys. Anywhere, anywhere. It was a good game, I think. We just came out on the short end. Uh, we made a few mental errors that cost us, but uh, I think you know two good teams at the end, and I think Stratford played well and, and deserved it. And you know, if we're going to lose to somebody, I'm glad to see them win the first. I'm Marshall Ellis and Stratford A's are now the new champions of the KCBL League. And I'm his mom. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so proud of my boy. <laughs> Everybody's just unbelievable happy because it took like the Morel has won a number of championships over the years, so a little more exciting to us than them. I'm sure they'd be quite excited too if they had not won again. Don't mind you, don't get me wrong. But very hard team to beat. Very hard team to beat. You don't know until you get the final out and the final in and then you're going to beat them. I think the tough part of the game, uh, twice we had the bases loaded and I think we only cashed in one run. That could have really changed, changed it. A couple of big hits and, and grab a bigger lead and I think you know the outcome could have been different, but we just didn't cash in when we hit our chances. I'm Aquinas Ryan, president of the Kings County Baseball League. It was a great game, very close. Uh, Morell sort of struggled all the way through the game. Probably the uh, their star pitcher, Grant Doyle, wasn't as sharp as usual. But uh, anyway, Stratford persisted. They played well. Final score was 5-4 uh, for Stratford Athletics. What's your name? Ty Labels. And what were you doing today? I was um, being the back boy for um, the Chevy, Merle Chevy's team. And is that your dad that plays? Yes, my dad plays on this team. Diving into the alleys, over the shoulder. For someone who didn't get to see the game, what was it like? <laughs> it would probably be, um, for a Mel Chevy's fan, it'd be a little disappointing. Thank you very much. Get out of here! Get out of here!